Alright, welcome back to some more Mario. We're going to continue where we left off. Um, I got a new controller, actually, and... I should rather say it's not new, it's just um, I got the battery pack. Oh gosh, does this feels so much smoother. I think it was the actual controller that I was using prior to this. I have so much more control over Mario. Let's run that back. Um, and I'm actually listening to the audio. Some of what I was told was it sounds like I'm in a trash can as you hear my voice. So. I don't know what that's about. Everything sounded legit before. I'm at 4 dB and I'm using a computer microphone that's it's internal. So. I don't know. But the jumps are a little bit better. They're not like they were before. I feel like I have way more control. Maybe it was the batteries. I don't know what was going on with that other controller, but I won't be using it in the future, I can tell you that. Dang, I missed that. So how is everybody? I hope you're doing well. I saw Weezer and the Pixies. That concert was alright. Alright only because the Pixies came through and saved it. You know, no offense to Weezer, they came out swinging. The problem was they didn't sustain that for me. They had their. They played a song I don't like, and uh, that song is Aha Take On Me. I know that's sacrilege for some of you, but. Just not my thing. I had bad experiences with that song as a kid. So, you know. Unfortunately, River's voice did not make that any easier for me to cope with. So you hear that and then some of the newer stuff, which I'm also not a fan of. So, by newer stuff, I mean after the Red album, it just went pop. Like, Weezer suffers from the, uh, same reason why people don't like Big Bang Theory. Some, you know, that don't. That's why you don't like Weezer. It's like, they went mainstream and... I know that's a lame thing to say. Like, of course they want to be mainstream. They want people to buy their albums and stuff. But, you know, that's not what being a nerd is all about. A nerd is not being, about being accepted and all that. But whatever. Um, I'm not here to have that argument or conversation. I just wanted to uh, bring it to folks' attention. Like, can I actually kill him? No, you cannot kill that guy. So here we go again. And I'll be going again. But thank goodness for this controller. Um, I was ready to try to get the PS3 going. But let's go back to. Um... Oh, you still. I gotta hit him underneath. I'm not paying attention. And that is a game over, ladies and gentlemen. Fortunately, I don't have to do those levels over now. But... Oh, I do have to do a cheese break over. So, you know, the Pixies I'm not as familiar with as I am Weezer, but they played some songs that were good and it felt like a good balance, you know. Even if you didn't know the song, it's like, oh, this next song up, somebody somewhere knows that and, you know, it's a good song. Really? They just screwed me out of the cave right there? 
I was, I don't know what I was thinking here. So, the blame game is not on the controller this time, it's on me. I thought Kim Deal was still in the band, but she isn't. They replaced her with Paz with Chanton. I'm sorry if I'm saying her name wrong, but I love Paz. She did uh, some work with The Perfect Circle, some remixes of some songs that I highly enjoyed. Uh, the Hunger, I was listening to that in college all the time. Oh my goodness. <sighs> So she played uh, Gigantic, which I didn't know was about interracial relationships. Or at least a uh, black guy dating a white girl. Based on some movie, but for some reason I guess I like the song even more. I don't know. Because it, it, it didn't make sense to me before what she was talking about, and then once I saw some kind of. Why do I keep doing that? I saw some kind of video about, you know. what it was on and that that made me appreciate it more. But I learned how to play that song. What I ended up doing was going to a pawn shop the very next day and um, I bought a used guitar and as of this recording I went to uh, get some new strings on the guitar because they were pretty beat. The old ones were I should say. How did I get hit there? I am just awful today. Like, what this feels like, if you've seen Game Grumps play Mario Maker, that's what this feels like. And I'm not that bad at Mario World, believe you me. That's not what this is. Like, I want to say it's peanut butter gamer level platforming, but I'm much better than that. I just, I don't know. Uh, I would love to make the excuse that I haven't, you know, talked while playing video games, but I, I've done that enough to where I should be much better than this. Much, much better. And I want to just end the video because I feel like I'm disappointing all of you. I'm on the same freaking level. So let me continue rambling. Back to the guitar. Um, I ended up getting that, so that was neat. Uh, it worked out. I was able to get it at the price I wanted, about, you know, 40 bucks. And once I got it, you know, with new strings and cleaned up a bit, that was about uh, $60 all together I paid for the guitar. Not bad. Not one of these fancy smancy name brands, but it allows me to do what I wanted to do, which is now that I'm on my own in my house again, I could, uh, you know, play whatever kind of songs I want to play. So, you know, I'm clumsy and I keep headbutting that stupid uh, block just to get the cape, and it's not worth it. Maybe it's all nerves, you know? I really don't know what it is that has me failing pretty badly in the beginning, only to play a little bit better later. I just need to be more zen, more relaxed, you know? Huh. What I just did right there is not what needs to be done. Can you go down there? No. I just feel like I beat it already, so... annoying to me that I have to do it again. And what was that? Yeah, I have no words really. I think before I found some like secret um, level or something like that, or secret parts of the level, it allowed me to bypass most of it. So 
a certain part where I kept getting hit. I think it was right there. Alright, so there's that stupid level out of the way. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I've been having fun with the guitar. Uh, helped somebody with the computer. I did my book club. Everything's coming up Millhouse. I got a fan for like... I don't know, it was like $10 at a thrift store. I have been looking for one for quite some time, so I'm going to install that in the game room because it's got a, just a light fixture in there and it, it really needs some ventilation, some air coming in there that doesn't require me to constantly have a fan on. Wow, what a jerk. But, uh, I had a neighbor sell some, um, what do you call those, some lawn chairs that I really wanted because I went to the beach and fishing and all that, and those would have came in handy. He sold those not thinking about me or remembering that I was, you know, telling them they should have been on hold. And I recently went to Walmart after getting something. You want to know why? Because when I went to this concert, me and my friend that went had nowhere to sit. We were just going to stand the whole time. And I misunderstood thinking that um, that 7 to 8 30, or 7 30 to 8 30, like it said, was for, um, you know, the duration of the show. But in reality, it was just the start time. So somebody was so annoyed with me me standing that they rented some, um, what the heck is going on here? They rented some lawn chairs for me to sit on. And that was awesome. So now I've got my own. I'll be at another concert soon, I hope. Did that really send me all the way back? Alright, whatever. I swear those things are getting on the nerve. They are. pop out of nowhere and my reflexes are bad because I've been playing uh, what the heck is going on here? Give me that. Guess I can't get it unless I have Yoshi. I'm gonna start using save state. I just wanna get to the dumb castle. Yeah, we're using save state guys. Sorry, you're not gonna like it, but uh I'm gonna you start using them. Move out of my way. You should have never been holding me up to begin with. Get off the screen. Wow. Really don't have time. Let's just go. So, uh, thank you again for the Patreons and the new subscribers. I really appreciate all of you. Please bear with me during this time. I'm trying to record as much as I can. And trying to get better and make better quality videos. Um, please keep telling your friends and keep watching. I'm going to get the audio right at some point. This is always kind of trippy because you're nervous about making mistakes and what have you. 
So I think I'm doing better on the castle than the actual platform. Well, let me not jinx myself. Oh, God. Where was my spin jump? Do I not have my spin jump? Yeah, where was that? Got the spin jump, just didn't get away from that stupid thing. Maybe I'm going over how the mic is supposed to sound. Okay, so... But yeah, it's at 4 dB, maybe it needs to be at the default? Let's try it again. Oh, well, still at 4 dB, so I don't know. How many lives? Really? Only one? Alright, so we're saving because I'm not doing any of that over again. I know people don't like that, but you know, it's not like it's how it used to be where it's like, hey, I'm saving right here because I'm in the middle of the level. No, I'm not doing Stupid Cookie Mountain over again or um, Cheese Bridge, none of that stuff. We're just going to go forward and move on. See, it, it kind of hurts you to be little. I'm sorry, it hurts you to be big because uh, you're trying to avoid those spikes. Wow. Yeah, let's go. Don't care. I hate that screen. I wish I had the, the Seamus screen that uh, just shows load state and what have you and not show your emulator or whatever. And yes, I have a real copy of Super Mario World, so if you're one of those elitists, you know, you know what you can do. You can go write your local congressman, and I'm not going to say the rest because this is a PG channel now. And you know what? Maybe I, that's not the right thing to classify it as. But I will say these hacks are, are going to have less profanity in them. I think that's for the best. Now, other stuff that's on the channel, that's up for debate. How did I not make it? Game over. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. What? I mean, I thought I was running pretty fast. See, imagine being big right here and trying to get through that unscathed. And this is just like a, hey, you know, free hit here. Like how fast do you have to be? So now I'm running like 90 miles per hour. It's like a Sonic the Hedgehog level. I got through there. Boy, get a power up, maybe. I've just been climbing like straight up. I don't even remember this. All right. Is this red?
Reznor? Not quite Reznor, this was Ludwig or whatever. Alright, you know what? I gotta save it because that was the last life anyway. And we're not doing any of that stuff ever. There's one hit on him. Whoa! I don't remember the screen being able to advance that far. But then again, it's been a while. That should do it. So about 20 minutes into this, wow. So, thank you for watching. I'm going to wrap it up here. I hate that it's only two levels. So that's a recap of this week. I think that's how I'm going to start doing these things. So I'm going to use my brain to solve the next puzzle. A perplexing forest. So I'm not sure if it's the forest of illusion that's next. I think that's what it is. We're about to see you right here. And it is. So next time when we come back, Force of Illusion 1. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend. Tell your brother. Tell your mother. Until then, I'm going to make like a bad check and bounce.